Oh yeah, man. ZR1. Look at that. Yeah. Woo. Yeah. You saw Ryan taking pictures. He loves ZR1. Probably just as much, if not more, than Dad. And if you're a Corvette fan, enthusiast, lover, owner, how could you not love a piece of history like the ZR1 and the C7 Corvette? Hey everybody, thank you again for coming back to my Corvette channel. So you saw it in the title, what don't I like about the C8 Stingray R graphics package? We'll come back to this car right here. That's Larry's car. We'll tell you why here in just a moment. Woo, look at that. I love coming back to the shop to see what's going on with these babies. And I love seeing my buddy over here, Chuck, who's putting in the strut tower covers. What's up, man? Not much, how you guys doing? Doing great. Look at this thing. We got to get you some pictures of this. When you guys order yellow and you do a black interior, you do it right, in my opinion, when you do the yellow seat belt and the stitching. Oh, man. Stay tuned. Motor come right here. Okay. Looks like he's just about done. I came back here today to talk about what's in this. The Stingray R graphics package. Unbeknownst to me, it's a dealer installed option. How come you didn't install these? Yeah, I'm not gonna. Yeah. I'm gonna show you what's in the back. You got a knife on you? I'm not allowed to have such things. <laughs> <laughs> that I believe. <laughs> Let's open this up, show you what's in the package, and then we'll decide uh, what's gonna go on Larry's car going to Texas. Gotta call him and see if he even wants the stuff on there. Chuck says, Rick, you putting these on? I said, man, I don't know. Just, yeah, come on. How are we gonna open them? Where are we gonna open them? On the edge. With the later release of the options, many of you haven't even seen this. Maybe you saw it on the build configurator and you wasn't quite sure what it was or what you got. So, today, you don't want that part on the block. <laughs> As he struggles to get it out of the box. Try to get it out of the box. We'll show you here in just, <laughs> just a second. This, this is why I don't do this. You need some stuff. help there, Sally? Yeah. Of course they're all taped down. Okay, so they're all taped up. We can't see a darn thing. So this is it. This is the whole kit. I would assume so. All right. Well, I gotta show you more than that. Hang on. Looks like got a hood piece, two side pieces, and a front piece. Okay. Let's take these off a little bit so we can flip them over so the guys can see what they are. At least one of these. So I think this goes down the side that would have been on the ground effects piece that goes up in that rear quarter. So you can, if you elect to, put it on the side of the car or you can put it wherever the heck you want to put it. I think this one just says Stingray R. You can see it. Okay, there it is. Yeah, Stingray St R. Stingray R. Okay, so these were intended to go on the edge of the ground effects. So Larry did not get ground effects. So I got to call him and see if he wants another car. If so, where he wants another car, you can still put it down in that lower quarter section if you want. What now? What the heck is that? It's that. It's okay. <laughs> what the? I bet it goes with this one though. You know what it is? I bet this goes past the emblem on the front nose. I bet this is for the front nose piece. Yeah. Oh, you want to look at this one? Is it part of the package? We're trying to show the package. Are you paying attention here? This thing is on. Cool, cool. I mean, I want to see it. it as much. Yeah, it's on. I want to see it as much as you guys want to see it. Well, it looks like the piece we just looked at, just in a larger version. Right. Oh, yeah, man, that's the Jake, uh, Jake skull. And if you could see down in there, those are Corvette emblems on top of each other, just like they are. Are they Corvette emblems? They look like it. Yeah, they are. Are they? Need my yeah, they are. yeah, no, no. <laughs> I was getting dizzy looking at the darn thing. Yeah, they're Corvette emblems. Okay, so, yep. Yeah. yeah. All right, so there you go. That is what is in the Stingray R graphics package that you can still use, whether you do that. Very expensive, very dramatic, awesome looking, though. Ground effects package. So if you don't have it, where are you going to 
Where are you gonna put that stuff on the car? I would say you could put that down into here, the Stingray R right there, because that's essentially where it's gonna go if you have the ground effect, so that's something to think about. That's, that's probably what I would do is put it down there. So here's Larry's car, not completely prepped yet, because as you see, the Stingray R graphics package is not on the car. So I did talk to Larry and I said, hey, do you want this thing? Because we ordered it and he says, I'm not quite sure if I'm gonna put it on. He says, yes, I do want it installed. So what I don't like about that package, we may have already mentioned it back with Chuck, but just again to reiterate, I don't like the fact that we have to put it on. I mean, at least GM, if you could have put this part on for us, the big part, and that little triangle piece actually comes down into here, as you'll see in some pictures in just a moment. It doesn't come around here as I earlier had thought. So it actually comes here, the little piece right here, just on top of the emblem. And if you do the build configurator from Chevrolet, because that Stingray R graphics wording, where does it go? Well, I'll throw up some pictures here in a second. On the build configurator, they put it here. Personally, I think it looks better down here. So Larry actually said, Rick, I'm gonna give you the executive decision to put them where you think they, they look best. I, I, you guys tell me what you think of the comments, but I'm going there, man. I'm gonna go right down there instead of up here, because I, I don't know. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think about the graphics. Here's where if you build it online with Chevrolet, and of course right now it's still the 2021 builder, but this is a 2021 car. Here's what Chevrolet suggests they go. So I'm just really bummed and we got to get an outside company to come in, although your boy Ricky may attempt to put this on here. It's not as big as a hood as we've had in the past, but man, it's a $700 graphics package. I screw that sucker up. Uh, I, I don't know. So I'll let you know how that goes. And also we're going to be putting on a red high wing. So how sweet is this car going to look with a little graphics, red car, trident wheels, red calipers, and a red high wing. It's gonna look hot, man. <laughs> all right, that's all I got for you today. A quick one, a fun one, always on point, talking Corvette and interjecting some ideas and some questions and, and all the stuff that we do throughout the day representing this car. Again, it's great to have you on the channel. I want you to come back, so if you haven't yet, please subscribe, thumbs up the video, make those comments down below. And before you go, because you like looking at cool cars, I promised you a ride segment. So here's mine, and here are your beautiful rides. <laughs>